Yo, everybody! This is the Uranic Shelf Danger Sign, 550 feet for three stars. 574.1 feet is the seasonal objective. Uh, this one I do have, I think, like three videos on. One where there is no snow, uh, two when there is snow. So I figured I'd just combine the two snow ones into one video. Um, one of those videos I'm starting over here on the west, one I'm starting over here on the east. I think the east you can go quite a bit further. There's a unique challenge to that side. But I'll start over here on the west side first. Uh, the challenge on this side is just avoiding a whole boatload of rocks. If you can do that, hit the ramp. It's still a little challenging, actually, to get your distance. This one in general is kind of hard. Actually, it might take several approaches, uh, you know, several attempts and whatnot. Anyway, let's go ahead and get to this. I'm in the monster. There's a dude trying the same approach. All right, let's see if we do it here. Nope. So, on that last run, I said nope. And what I should have been saying was yup, because I did go far enough. For some reason, in my back of my mind, I was thinking I need to go 600 feet. I have no idea why. I guess that's what happens when you get old. Anyway, from this side, we'll do this approach again. You kind of park yourself right around this R on Rannick there. Uh, you face downhill, and like I said, you can go way further on this approach. It's You do have the same challenges. You have a bunch of rocks. The hardest part of this one, though, is even though you go through those two little flags, a lot of the times it won't register. You need to change your angle, you know, rewind and change your angle just a fraction. And it, um, just keep doing that until it does register. So you're probably seeing me rewind, um, maybe in several times, just to actually get through the flags. But you'll see once you do, you go much, much further. Um, you can ride around, land right around this river, even. And the distance is absolutely no problem going from this direction. So let's give this route a go. And still in the Mosler. And at nighttime. I can already tell it's a horrible aim there. Started off pretty good there, just for some reason decided it'd be a good idea to go off track. Here we go. Oh. Rocks to the right, rocks to the left. If you can do the exact same thing twice in a row, you should. Because it only proves your stupidity. Alright. Oh, wow. I'm not sure what the hell I'm hitting there. Because I don't even see rocks. There we go. 652.35. But it's not nearly as far as I've gone on that jump. I'm taking that route. And winter is something to do with it there. Plus, I'm kind of in a crappy snow car in the Mosler, but I just used it because everyone has it or you don't have it. It's really easy to get off the auction house. But there you go. Both ways you can do this. Like I said, this one is kind of a pain, um, but you'll get it down. See you guys.